Hello my Aries, how you guys are doing? Today we'll do the weeklyest reading for you guys and that will be from the 1st till the 7th of March Okay, keep in mind it's a general love reading and will not resonate with all of you Alright Aries? So let's see here, we have three decks to use and to see how the energies are and who is the person you're dealing messages from your person and also action for you to take towards your decision okay also we'll see what the time frame is in the reading if it, the cards will show us okay so let's see Aries for first seven days of March first till seven all right, Aries, let's see here what we got in general energy overall. So we have Seven of Cups, we have Knight of Wands, we have the Fool, and we have the Hangman. All right. I feel here now you make a decision to go towards what you, what's fulfilling. You are not sure what you want. I'm feeling here I'm talking with somebody young, very young energy here, like I'm thinking to go forward, I don't know what if I need to go, because it's a lot of thinking, it's a lot of unclear energy in your life at this point, yes yeah, Aries, I'm feeling here you like one step forward, two steps back, okay? That's how you feel here, okay? If I'm feeling here, you could have a Sag in your life or somebody younger than you with Sag energy in their chart. Could be a Sag, could be a Gemini here. But I'm I'm feeling here, you're not really going, you want to go towards them, but I'm feeling they are going towards some something else like they might have a lot of options in their lives or they might like i don't really want to be in a relationship i'm still loving the way i am now okay but let's see how the energies plays with other cards and we'll see okay the world Power, the Knight of Cups, the Wheel of Fortune, Ace of Wands, Queen of Cups, the Sun, the Moon, and Six of Pentacles. You manifested this, okay? I'm feeling here you want to take a leap of faith with this person. They could take the Sag energy, but I'm feeling here it's a water sign, a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces in your life. That by surprise they want to have a new, a new beginning with you, okay? Or you, Aries, want a new beginning with them. I can tell you they still have passion for you. They still want to be with you. You make them happy. Okay. Leo energy here. Pisces energy here. Cancerian energy. But I'm feeling here, they still passion. But I feel you're dealing with a, with a karmic partner. It's something fated to, to happen here. Okay. And... What I'm feeling here, they come with this offer of love, but they're not here to commit to you. They're not here for staying long term, okay? And I'm feeling here, this person needs more balance in their life. Like, they might come very quick into your life, like you don't even really expect for them to come. And they might even blurry you with a new beginning, okay and you might even be tempted 
to go into this trap because I feel here it's a trap for you kind of because they might even tell you let's go let's move let's let's make it work but you know they are very tricky you know that they are in the past didn't commit they made you very confused about this I feel for some of you they lie to you they hide a lot of secrets from you and I'm feeling here you are a little unbalanced in your life they make you happy I can I can see that okay but they put you to think are you Aries really wants to be with you, with this person are you really want to steal in this unfair energy because whatever they bring they just bread crumbing you I don't feel they really want to commit you could have a child or kids with them and they've been like because I don't see here a marriage I don't see a married person here I see somebody which make you think they love you they have passion with you they want to be with you but in the fact they are very immature because I don't see here mature energy for them they I don't feel they even offer you something like stable if you want stability you have all the tools to believe them or not okay but the situation is this month this week this month okay this person it is coming here for having a new beginning okay yep and communication is up the ground here you communicate back and forth back and forth with them yeah they might even come and travel towards you also they appear as a magician too they're very strong person too believe me or not and they might even come with this offer to tell you I want to commit to you yeah they might tell you I, I love you let's make it work but I don't really feel you you believe them I feel here is uncertainty yep they they want to come back because they want to I feel here you you know they will come back around you know now you are in charge with whatever it is in your life you are in charge with them you know them you know them very well Aries very well and you know that they are not the person to commit here okay but let's see here you will think a lot of what they will say because I feel here text call like a talk it's here in this place yeah but I feel here now they're getting their awakening situation in their life that hey what you do probably that's why they're coming back they're very confused towards your towards what they feel towards you that's why they want to come back here but I'm feeling you are still like still heal from the past hurt because I feel here this person is a little selfish even they show love even they appear as a queen of cups here they are very selfish yeah but I'm feeling here they want if you have kids with this person they want something stable because they are unstable and you make them stable believe me or not yeah, Cancerian energy, you could deal with the Cancer when uncommitment. Yeah, they might even live out of distance. They might even travel to see you. But don't expect too much of honesty from them. They they might even offer you sex when they come in. And you're just like, nah, 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 nah. Because I feel this person is not with true intentions. No, they are not. And I'm feeling here, you know it. You've been through a battle with this person and they destabilize you. 
you are not stable and now you're just protecting your heart and you know they're not coming here for commitment you know they're not coming here to stay they come in fast living fast okay and you know whatever they say is not really the truth nope four days one week one month yeah they might seem very you know stable when they come they might even be very good with their words because they come as magician and you come as magician but boy you know this person you know what they say they might even feel like you know in the past didn't work let's work it now okay so you could deal with a fire sign Aries, Leo, Sag, a fellow fire Sag here you could deal with a Taurus you could deal with a water sign Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces we have Cancer, we have Pisces you could deal with a Leo here too okay but let's see, or the Gemini too but let's see here, this person you are connected what the messages are from them they watching you, they watching you from afar very mature energy, yeah very mature energy here but they take their sweet time air energy, earth energy Aquarian energy, but I feel here and the chariot. I feel here They're not coming with the true intention. They come to break you down again and again Okay, be very very aware because the magician sometimes is a sneaky person Who comes and leave who comes and leave and they tell you again 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 the lie they break your heart again and again and again they're not telling you the truth they are not they're very mature they are not they give you very small and i don't feel you really want it you really want to be with them they show like they're very caring they're very good but for real what they coming back is just for intimacy here and they will leave you more confused than you are at this point okay what the messages for you my aries you want love, you want a new beginning, but you know will never work. You might even feel like a little depressed at this time because this person comes in and out because you want stability, you want marriage, you want a commitment, you love them, you want a new beginning with them. You might even tell them, I want a new beginning with you. I'm done with all this. But I'm feeling here eventually you want to move forward like just go seeking love yep and you'll speak it the truth here i'm feeling here for many of you you choose what's best for you and with queen of swords here in your part again queen of cups in on the bottom strongly water sign here for you aries but i'm feeling here with the queen of swords you might tell them you're not giving me this ace of cups this true feeling i'm thinking i'm done with you i choose a different direction and i'm feeling here you you're doing great because protecting your heart from a sneaky person that's the right way all right my aries choose what's best for you this person is confusing you more and more and more every time they're coming they're very selfish, very just for themselves. I don't feel them... You make them happy. They make you happy. But at some point, you see it's not going anywhere. And it's just like bread crumbing you. And you're just like protecting yourself now. Because you know they look like, I want to commit, I want to be with you. They're very, very strong individual very manipulative they manipulate you in that way that you believe them and I feel now you know who they are and what they are intention okay all right my Aries this is what I got for you and I'll see you next time bye for now